I know what you're all thinking. Is she serious? And yes, you're quite right to think so. Because rice is consumed by millions of people each day. And if rice could kill cancer, then the number of cancer cases should be quite low. But the number of cancer cases is quite high. In fact, according to the World Health Organization, cancer has claimed 8.8 .8 million lives. So what is this rice that I'm talking about? I'm talking about whole grain colored rice. Yes, colored rice. Red, purple, black, and even speckle. And these colored rice, this whole grain colored rice, has the outer layer, the bread, still intact. And it is the good chemical compounds that is present in this bran layer that is believed to have antioxidant properties. Antioxidants are chemical compounds that when consumed goes into your body and actively removes toxins. These toxins are like unwanted relatives. You can't avoid them and you can't live with them. Because if left unattended, these toxins can promote lifestyle diseases such as cardiovascular disease, obesity, diabetes, and even cancer. So if colored rice is so good, why haven't we been consuming it since the beginning of time? Well, because as a civilization, we are a bit like my mom. My mom is a lady who likes to eat chicken with white legs. And to find chicken with white legs in an island country is really, really difficult. But my poor dad, no matter how broke he was, would go and find chicken with white legs because that is what pleased his lady. And like my mom, as a civilization, we have a visual preference of food even before we consume it. And quite so, because white rice goes well with our sushis, it goes well with our curries, and it goes well with our stir fries. But in doing so, we have chosen a lesser nutritious option over a more nutritious one. And just how nutritious is this whole green colored rice? Is what my research is trying to find out by looking at the effect it has on cancer cells. How do I do this? I take concentrated compounds of this colored rice and put them on gut cancer cells and compare them to normal cells. And voila, what do you know? The gut cancer cells died, whereas the normal cells were absolutely fine. So ladies and gentlemen, rice can kill cancer. And so what does this mean to the everyday consumer? This means that now they have a nutritious option which doesn't only satisfy hunger, but it also protects against diseases. So I have urged the greater population not to be like my mom and to take the more nutritious, colorful diet. Thank you.